Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to part 60 of this Pokemon Leaf Green Let's Play. So we are now on the second floor of the Indigo Plateau, and we've got more puzzles, more rocks to move. And let's totally skip fighting these wild Pokemon, because we have bigger fish to fry. We will call upon our sturdy uh, Clefairy. And <laughs> our level 12 Clefairy. Oh gosh. More of these guys. These Geodudes. It's a pretty high level Geodude. And that just unlocked something for us over here. And we're running into Onyx. There we go. And we get another battle. This year's Victory Road is the final test for trainers. And really quick, I'm going to do something really quick. Sorry if you see my mouse on the screen, but I'm going to adjust the brightness just a little bit down. Uh, it seems a little bit too bright. So, apologize for that. I am playing this from my cartridge, though. But uh, just with the capture card, it was showing up just a little bit too bright. So I wanted to give a little bit better color for you there. Let's do our standard uh, hypnosis and uh, dream eater. There we go. One hit wonder. Of course, no surprise there. It was a, a type difference there. I guess we'll just keep going with that. This guy likes his the chops and the chokes. I've always wondered, like under the arms of the chop. Are those like ribs? Are those gills? I mean, what's going on there? Let me know if there's ever been like some kind of Pokedex entry for that or, or something, because it's super strange. Alright, Black Belt Daisuke. Daisuke. Man, we've had some good luck with that hypnosis. I am worried, though. One thing that has me worried is that uh, we are going to run out of PP. Because uh, I think we've got some difficult battles ahead of us still. And... Man, we're climbing the ladder with Haunter. Acho! Alright. Goodbye, sir. And let's go talk to this... Or not go talk to this. Let's go get this uh, Pokeball really quick. By the way, if you're watching this as the uh, as it comes out, then you are watching this as my first video in 2019. So happy New Year to you. TM37 Sandstorm. That is a good move. That I will not give any of my Pokemon. And man, the wild the wild Pokemon are just just they want to be noticed. Oh, who's this guy? Oh come on, stop. We gotta get the we gotta get the block and push the block all the way over here, I think. If not we'll battle that electrician or whatever he is. Of course we don't care about Zubats. Oh, this guy's running around. Down to full heal. Come on, I'll whip you. He thinks he will. Oh my gosh, he will whip us. Is he holding a flower? Tamer Vincent. He's gonna send out his his cat at us. The one that he assume whips. Which is not cool. Not cool at all. We'll put it to sleep though. 
I mean, I guess my best attack is Dream Eater, but I don't want to run out of that. So I'm just going to use Shadow Punch. Oh, turns out Shadow Punch doesn't work. I thought that would attack uh, anybody, it would work on anybody, but I guess it doesn't. So we really don't have a choice, we're going to have to use Dream Eater. Okay, looks like it's going to take two Dream Eaters. And then I probably got to switch this guy out, uh, just so we don't run out of PP too fast. But I think we've got our uh, level 50 Haunter here. There we go. Golduck. Yeah, we'll switch that out for Raichu. Definitely uh, get Raichu leveled up here. Yeah, the more I'm playing this, the more I'm thinking I'm definitely going to have to uh, um, do some grinding to get my Pokemon leveled up enough to beat Lance and uh, the champion. I got whipped. Yeah, you did. Goodbye, Tamer Vincent. There's another guy over here. That would be a wild onyx. That is level 45. Dang, that's pretty good. Um, I'm going to switch this out. Just, I have no idea what I'm going into, but we got to level up our Charizard. So, should be interesting. Is Victory Road too tough? It's not too bad yet. Juggler. Ugly Gregory. Mr. Mime, so we don't have anything with my Charizard that's going to be a huge type difference. Um, let's just uh, go fly. And Psychic is a pretty good move. Took about half of Charizard's HP away. And we beat him. Well done. And we got Hail. It's Geo, dude. Did we battle this guy already? Of course. There's a wild goal bat that struck up our fancy. Oh man. Okay good, it let us get away. I was gonna say, if it was gonna make it so we couldn't get away. Oh yeah, it looks like we did beat him. You've earned the right. Jerk. Okay, what do we do with this? Let's get this thing over here. I heard rumors of a child prodigy. Would that be me? Or is that gonna be my rival? Because we're both children, I think. Sweet. This is just right up our alley here. I'm gonna go with flamethrower. Because it still should do the trick. Type difference and then the level difference. I think this should be enough. And looks like it was. Goodbye, Executor. Some good experience for us. Electrode. I'm going to switch him out. And I don't know really what I should switch it out for. Oh, gosh. This will do Raichu. And then I'm going to focus on some of his uh, slam type moves. I just sincerely hope that he doesn't go for uh, um, self-destruct. Shouldn't do much. But it paralyzed him. Great. And of course you missed. 
I don't know how this electrode has higher speed than Raichu, but whatever. Um, I know that paralysis, you know, give Raichu the last move, but whatever. Dang it. Let's switch this back over. I guess technically we could have uh, used um, Charizard with this. We could use some good um, flying type moves. Of course, that didn't beat Sand Slash. Not a strong move. Oh, of course, stupid Cool Trainer using his Hyper Potion, delaying the inevitable. Here we go. Let's take care of him. Well, that light screen's off. It's gonna make it easier. Cloisters, so that's ice. Yeah, we'll switch it out. Let's see. Hopefully we can get a good shot in. Before he takes too much damage. Full we'll trainer George with his with his lucky paralysis. So now I definitely don't want to switch out my Pokemon the spikes are on the play. But yeah, we're able to land that though. Excellent. It's a sweet level up for Raichu. Arcanine. Let's uh, throw it back over to Nidoking. That did some damage. And of course, we got Intimidate. Forgot about that. But we're 10 levels above. But Arcanine is, uh, if not the best, one of the best stats in uh, Pokemon. And we lucked out with a critical hit and a super effective. Excellent. The rumors were true. That was not a pleasant one for us. We took a lot more. And it's just for max revive. Okay. I don't know where to push this yet. I'm guessing over to the left here. Nope. Maybe up above. Alright, let's push this. It's a big boulder. Oh gosh, these wild Pokemon are the worst. No, I don't care, Sand Slash. Go away. Jeez. Okay. Just want to make sure I'm pushing it, uh, you know, on the right, uh, you know, the upper or the lower. I want to make sure I'm doing it right. Man, these Pokemon are killer right now. Okay. Yeah, that's where I've got to push it, so we want the lower one. Oh, overheat, that's a good move. I'm just going to do little spurts of running, but of course it didn't work because these dumb wild Pokemon still found us. Just leave me alone. Oh, gosh. And I'm too cheap to buy repels. I swear you move like 10 steps and they're done. Even max repel is a waste. Oh gosh, okay. I know we need to deal with that sound effect of moving the rock. I love how it's the same sound. isn't difficult. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom, boom. I swear this was more difficult in the original one, in the blue version and red version. But then again, it's been years since I've made it this far in it. So I can't remember if the puzzles are different or the same. Okay, so we just did something over there. 
Gosh dang it. You know what I'm going to do though, is I'm going to go down those stairs really quick. I think it saves uh, when you've placed a stone. Let's find out. Yeah, nope, it doesn't. That was a waste. May as well finish up what we're going to do down here though. If you can get through here, you can go meet the Elite Four. Pokemaniac. Trying to look like a Charizard or something. Okay. I'm not going to deal with this guy. I'm just going to fly. I'm not going to switch it out. Metal Claw. Why does he want to use Metal Claw on me? Or even a fire move at that And there we go. Goodbye, Charmeleon. Sweet, we got a level up. Nothing like more stats. Lapras, yeah, that's a that's a difference right there. In type. Bring it on. Great. This is definitely not what we want. Ugh. So it said there in three turns, all effective Pokemon will faint. Oh gosh. Raichu's just had some bad luck this game. Definitely, definitely not good. With the tongue. Ooh. Switch him out. I think we'll go with Haunter. I think we got a good choice here. If I remember right, Lickitung is normal type. So it won't be able to hurt Haunter. And of course, if we put to sleep anyway, we'll begin shape. Alright. Do some decent damage there. Yep, about half. Still asleep. That's good news. Here we go. And that's the end for Pokemon Maniac Dawson. Alright guys, well that's going to do it for this part. I want to thank you for watching. If you have not already, please consider subscribing. It helps me out, but lets you know when more videos come out. But anyway, stay tuned for the next part where we delve more deep and we solve more of these puzzles here inside Victory Road. We'll see you later.